All right, Cat, you ready? Yeah. The next weapon we'll be doing is Lance. The the Lance is really straightforward, really simple to use. Um, probably one of the, I'm going to say, like, maybe most beginner friendly um, with the potential of being one of the uh, most, most powerful weapons you could possibly get um, because of its versatility. Um, also, we have some sick looking armor right here. This is cool looking, like actually knight armor. Yeah, right. yeah. Sorry, so hold right block to go into a slow shield moving stance, but you're still slow even when not in it. You're not very quick with this weapon, but that's okay. Um, if you hit B, you'll stab into the air. If you hit Y, you'll stab forward. We don't have flinch free, that's great. If you hold Y and B, you'll do a charged horizontal slap. Um, I'm not really sure if that does too much more damage. <laughs> oh, goodbye. Uh, <laughs> I just keep going. Um, if you hold right trigger when you do Y and B, you will uh, start a charge. If you hit back on that movement stick, you should Go faster? end that charge. Oh no, okay. Because it felt like I started going faster. At the end of your charge, if you hit Y, you'll do a pretty heavy hit. At the end of the charge, if you hit B uh, and back, sorry, I think okay. I messed that up. It's B and back? Okay, I was like, it's oh, not nope. ending. <laughs> Hold on. It's B and back. I, I did it last time. You can do like a, there you go. If you do Y, B, oh, and B. back, you'll do, a, you'll do a slash behind you. So watch this. Charging and Y, B, and back. And you can slap behind you if you need to. Otherwise, you just do a Y and you'll stop moving for your forward motion. There's probably another way out of it, but what did I do? those are those, those functions. So, what you're doing is counter guard. Counter guard, if you um, block during the blue time, you'll do a tremendous amount of damage and hit back. If you block any time after, you'll just block the attack and hit back. Um, really powerful. If you're holding your shield and hit Y, you'll do a little pokey stab. It does less damage than the normal just stab, but you're, you'll also go right into guard. This weapon's super, super useful for staying out of danger, um, but it has crazy offensive ability too. So let's go ahead and look at... Um, let's go ahead and look at uh, our wire bug right. abilities. Yep. Yeah. Um... Twin Vine, a silk bind attack activated by LTY. You jab a kunai into the target. Remember, it has a really short range. Um, if you LT an A while the kunai is still lod uh, lodged into the monster, you'll actually launch yourself towards it while you're guarding. So make sure... Uh, sorry, no. And guard while you launch yourself towards it. So that means that this weapon, as long as you're in melee range for even a second... You can stab that kunai into it and just keep attacking. And as soon as it runs away from you, just LTA and launch yourself towards it and keep attacking. Really powerful. And then Anchor Ridge. Um, when, whenever you use this one, you'll guard. And whatever attack you're hit with will give you attack uh, additional attack power. If you're attacked with like a steppy stomp where the monster just seems to make a step and it hits your shield, you'll get a very small amount of damage boost. But if you're hit with something like um, the Magnamalo Super, you'll get a full damage boost. I don't know what the values are completely, but I know it's something on the level of like a steppy stomp would be like five extra damage, but then the Magnamalo's hit would be like 25. Like it's an insane increase in how much extra. Not, not on that level, but just the difference. Um... Also, if you uh, look over at, go to the left once from there, there's the yeah. counter thrust and guard. Counter thrust, if you're hit while in the stance, you'll automatically counter attack, quickly release right trigger to do a cancel thrust. Um, I, I don't know if we can show that without, no. You actually have to be hit for it to show that. Um, but you'll, you'll basically thrust and then go right into a cancel. But we can go try this now. The weapon's super simple, so... Um, it, I, what's up? I would like to point out one thing. My uh, my dog's name is Onion, and it's the best. No, <laughs> my mine's Masamune. But yeah, Onion, that's fantastic. 
Yes, he is the best onion. Oh, I did it again. We're kind of, we kind of look like onions, right? Kind of. Um, if you didn't notice, by the way, uh, we have our dogs in this. Even if we had four players, I think you still have your dog. No, you do have your dog. Um, even really? if you have four players, yeah. Um, the main thing is that once you go into multiplayer, you lose the ability to have your dog and your palico. Um, so even with just two players, you lose that, and you only so have one that or the other. Four player co-op. We also have four doggos. Well, I mean, how else would you ride your doggo? Uh, These are the hunting basics. I don't know. Exactly. Um. It's nice. Yep. Yeah. Here we go. Have you noticed my weapon is very shiny now? Yeah, how do you do that? That is the wire bug ability. Which one? The uh, block damage and get a shield. Yeah, which one? B or Y? Uh, that's B. I don't know if you see me constantly running up towards a... I'm glad I chose Tried to do the wire bug thing, but I wasn't close enough. I didn't mean to get off this wall. No. The little dudes are really abusing me. I did not mean to do that. I just hit him for 85. Stop, I don't think I'm stop ever hitting me. Get that, uh, orange thing you have. Here it comes. Nope. Nope. Oh. What? I did it. I thought it was up, but it didn't seem to do anything. Stop. <laughs> You're just stabbing into me without hitting the monster. Oh, actually, it was. Who was hitting him? Really? From that far away? Yeah, I saw damage numbers. At least I think it did. Remember to LTA to get to the monster if you've got your hook on him. Yeah. Wait, LTA? Yep. L, uh... This weapon's not as shiny and not as uh, crazy as, say, like the. Oh. Oh. Aw, that's that's sad. It's coming for you. As say, like the dual blades or uh, yeah. hunting horn or even hammers. Oh. It's also just too slow. I don't think I'm a big fan of shield anything. Have you have you seen how I've been attacking? I've literally been nonstop on him, flying through the air. Yeah, listen, I'm a noob and not as good as you. <laughs> I can't. You could definitely I, get there. The weapon, this weapon, is not too hard to understand. You just have to get used to. Once you jab into the monster, you, as soon as it gets any distance away from you, don't even bother moving. Just LTA. You'll le leap over to it. Oh my goodness. Here it comes. It requires you to have your wire bucket on it though, doesn't it? And I didn't always have it up. 
Oh, well, that's fair. Ooh, I'm very hurt. Ooh, Ooh that was close. Well, I beat him with a charging attack, I think. <laughs> I think you did. I don't think I was attacking you that time. Look at this wire on me. Ah! Oh, look, it's like that little game. Ring around the dead monster. You know, with the little... Oh, okay, fine. Let's do poses. <laughs> I'm like, poses, though? <laughs> um, yeah, my my thoughts. It's not personally for me, but I think mainly because I don't care too much for shield weapons. Um, not to say it's not fun, and I think people could enjoy it. It feels like it could be beginner-friendly, so I would recommend it for beginner beginners, but it's... Not my cup of tea. I know that, um... Based on what I saw... The... Strength, the damage this could put out... Seems a little wild. Lance hitting for 50 or 60, while hammers are hitting for 50s... Is... Is really high to me. I think that an experienced user... Could take this weapon and go just as high as, like, Longsword or or any of the higher tier weapons easily could. I agree. Uh, I just really didn't know what I was doing and not my play type. Not a bad weapon, but not my play type. Yeah. Anyway, that's it for this video. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe and comment down below. Yep, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Peace.